Hugh Leon McCall Jr. was born in Bennettsville, South Carolina on June 8, 1935 and was the driving force behind the creation of the first coast-to-coast -coast Superbank, Bank of America. During his childhood, his father would own controlling interest in the Marlboro Trust Company and become a cotton farmer on the side. Daddy put us to work early, and he taught me double-entry bookkeeping for the family farming business when I was 14. As a result, young McCall was well-versed in accounting, math, and finance, leading him to ace these courses during his college days at UNC Chapel Hill. He would land a job in 1959 at American Commercial Bank based in Charlotte, North Carolina. One year later, this top banking institution would be renamed North Carolina National Bank. The first chairman that I worked for was Allison Reese. He saw that we had to build the company as large as we could to compete, so he began to build the bank through mergers. He was succeeded by Tom Storrs, and he very quickly saw that if we didn't get out of North Carolina, we were going to die. Through a string of strategic acquisitions, NCNB would evolve into Nations Bank in 1991. Stores and I together expanded in Florida. We went to Washington and we changed the law that then allowed us to buy banks across state lines. After seven years and the acquisition of California-based Bank America Corporation, the first coast-to-coast -coast bank, Bank of America, was born. I never could have imagined growing up that I would end up having the life that I've had. It's been very enriching. I've had the opportunity and, and the ability to do many, many things.